Way in the back, and she didn't say anything. She just showed up one day. Yeah, she sat back there eating her plate full of haggis, Hormel chili, and Kentucky fried chicken. <laughs> and if I told a joke really good and ripped over my blouse correctly, whatever that means, she she mostly laughed, mostly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but she didn't say who she was, what she did. Uh -huh. She had a really aggressive name. Yeah, like, wow. Who is this person, a collection agent for the Gambinos? And she had a cast on her hoof, like she'd been in a fight with a bunch of gangsters or something. <laughs> and I got tired of it. I said, hey, what's this woman's deal? What is her deal? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what, I didn't know what it meant at the time. Now I do. Yeah. And I was like, hey, I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm tired of it. So I called up my friends on my 74 Alpine walkie-talkie. Thomas Magnum, Higgy Baby, TC, and, and, and Simon and Simon, two brothers. One's rugged and one has stock market skills. And I said, look, I don't care what it costs. <laughs> this woman, I don't know anything about her and what she's doing here and what, what and why she has a cast on her hoof and none of this. And uh, I need you to get to the bottom of it. Get down to the needy greedy. And, and then and don't call me back until you have information. And, 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 and then I said, now get to it, cook. Yeah, like that. And, and you know what they did? They all, they all got in uh, TC's helicopter. TC has his own helicopter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, hello, Debs. And and they and they flew in the helicopter. And they flew all the way to Walla Walla, Washington, and landed in the front yard. And, and, and one of the Simon and Simon brothers had a cowboy hat, and he held it like this because the wind. Woo, 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 woo. Yeah, and, and that, why Walla Walla? Because the, the library of Walla Walla is the biggest known place for microfiche in the whole wide world. <laughs> Stay with me now. now this is, we're getting down to the needy greedy. And uh, so Thomas Magnum, Higgy Baby, and TC, and Simon and Simon, well, they, they walked in there like, yeah, like big handsome hunks that they are. And they went inside the library, and they went straight to the microfiche room in the basement. <laughs> and they brought snacks, because they knew it was going to be a hard scroll. Yeah. And they went straight to microfiche scrolling. <laughs> so much scrolling on the microfiche. They had to get down to the needy greedy. <laughs> and they scrolled for two weeks. They scrolled so much that they got a headache and they had to take a BC powder. Mm -hmm. And then they felt better. And they kept scrolling another week and a half. They had to get down to the needy greedy. And then they kept scrolling. And they lost weight because they ran out of snacks. And then they, they, they found information. They got down to the needy greedy. And then... Then I got a phone. I got an Al, Alpine walkie-talkie uh, call from them, <laughs> and I was listening intensely, like this. And and Thomas Magnum, he's the one who called, and um, and uh, I could not believe my ears. I was like this. This is a reenactment. And I was like, what, what, huh? And, uh, my, my better ear. I go to a lot of concerts. Huh? <laughs> what? Huh? No way. What? 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 Huh? Huh? What? <laughs> okay. Wow. Well, thank you. Okay. Thank you for getting down to the needy greedy. Come to find out. Stay with me now. <laughs> this this lady is a world-renowned chainsawing artist in the land of Scotland. Aye. <laughs> Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> and 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 she's got a chainsaw. Yeah. <laughs> and she didn't brag one bit on the beautiful stuff she makes. She just showed up eating her plate of haggis, hormel, chili, and Kentucky fried chicken with a cast on her hoof. <laughs> and supposedly our live made her uh, feel uh, LOL inside. And that's good. And, uh, and she didn't brag one bit. So I brag for her. I give her a raise in praise. And now I crank her chainsaw as a sign of respect. And I, I still don't know exactly why uh, she's got, she had a cast on her hoof. <laughs> But all I'm saying is, if you borrow money from her, I recommend you pay it back promptly. And if you let her babysit your granny's poodle, be advised. The poodle will come back begging for haggis. <laughs> yeah. Yeah.